So we met late 2001, had our first date in February of 2002. We got married in um, August of 2004, and then he was diagnosed approximately a week after our one year anniversary. Um, and went through about eight months of treatment and was has been in remission since May of 2006 at the ripe old age of 26. The research is, is very important um, for, for a couple of reasons. Uh, selfishly, at, at some point, it's probably going to come back. Um, I mean, you can be in remission for 10 years, 20 years, and multiple myeloma dents does tend to come back. So I'd like to have the best best treatment available or cure, cure available would be, would be great, obviously. Um, but also, I don't want someone else to have to go through what I did. Um, it was hell. It's, it's terrible. It's obviously the better, better treatment that everyone else can get and the better treatment that I can get in the future. The biggest thing is obviously I want to be around to raise the kids and hold, hold my grandkids. Dance with your daughter at her wedding? See the kids graduate high school. It's the simple things. Be the baseball coach. You know, <laughs> the Cub Scout the leader. The Cub Scout leader. But ultimately, and, it's just to be there for the kids. I mean, it's it's fantastic that Dr. Brown was able to give this money to uh, research. Obviously, again, selfishly, that that benefits us. Um, it's a very specific and rare disease that I have. Having targeted research towards my disease is just, it's, it's fantastic. I, I, I can't thank Dr. Brown enough for that. You know, Dr. Brown having the foresight and understanding that immunotherapy is kind of the next great thing for cancer research. There are a lot of drugs out there for multiple myeloma, but they're not cures. They're just kind of drugs that will prolong people's lives. Immunotherapy is probably the next wave of how you can actually cure cancer, because it's targeted towards the cancer and it will help keep it away. So the fact that Dr. Brown understands that, is willing to donate $30 million to Indiana to do immunotherapy so that my husband may have a cure in five years, uh, speechless. <laughs>